What's up guys, girls, and Elgato HD 60S Plus capture cards? So, there's a lot of difficulties in GD, you know? There's, look at all these boys down here. Plus, there's like the five demon difficulties? I mean, come on! So today I'm gonna try and give them all equal representation in a level, and what I'm gonna be doing is, every 10 minutes I'm going to be increasing the difficulty. Now, I know a lot of you are probably looking at the title, and you're like, oh, that's not different levels. Okay, just imagine that every 10 minutes I went to a new level and did the same thing. I'm only putting them in one level, that way I don't have to upload 10 levels to my account. So y'all already know I can't decorate. So as usual, we're just gonna be doing this one like a layout, just like a 1.0 styled level because that's all I can do. So yeah, so we're gonna do 10 minutes for each segment and we're gonna go in increasing order of difficulty. So first up, that means we're starting with auto. We are starting with an auto level. So we have 10 minutes to build auto gameplay. So uh, I guess let's just do it. All right, three, two, one, let's go. Just trying to get some basic music sync down here, really. So we just, yeah, we just got some very, very remedial sync going on here because that's really all I feel like I can do. We'll do like a mini wave. I feel like you can do. I feel like you can do a lot of silliness with a with an auto mini wave. You know, I feel like this is a little bit too early. That's, that's too early. That'll work. Just gotta move these over. Can't wait to find out all the ways that this doesn't work. On like different refresh rates. All right, so what do we want to do? I think, I think we should do some silliness that's like almost impossible. Like that, you know? We should just really, we should really just be goofy with it, I think. We'll also do some invisible teleport portal aligners. Cause they're real, they're just so great, dude. I don't know why more levels don't use them. It's so nice to just guarantee that you will be in the exact same place every time you hit a portal. <laughs> okay, all right, so is this gonna work? <laughs> that looks awesome. Okay, all right, cool. And then, make like a nice long string of blue pads. Snap those bad boys. Perfect. And we just gotta do the same thing on this side. <laughs> Wait, what? Why did it break here? I'm gonna go back after this is done too and make these, uh invisible so they don't look so the pads don't look incredibly stupid and out of place uh, let's go back and focus on uh maybe some more background stuff oh wait i didn't even copy the color gotta copy color and turn that down just a little bit we can do some color theory all right now that i've spent three minutes messing with colors and zero minutes actually like working on like the structuring or anything like i said i was going to uh i think i think now's a good time to maybe start doing that just maybe oh it's almost time it's almost time for the beloved, the beloved sound. You already know what is coming up. There she is. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right. That's our auto part done. I think it's pretty good. Uh, it's not super long, but that's fine. Um, with that, we're gonna move on to easy. And I think how we're gonna transition into that is I think we're just gonna go, I think we're just gonna go back to a cube. I feel like a cube is a pretty easy game mode. So we're gonna do that. Okay, so we'll start about here. Uh, easy time, three, two, one, go. So easy levels don't have a lot going on. Uh, I feel like it's some basic jumps and that's about it. Like something like this, I feel like, I feel like that's, I feel like that's easy material. Um, I don't know if we should use orbs. I feel like orbs are a little bit advanced. I feel like we should keep it to simple spikes and jumps, you know? This is incredibly boring. I think I'm literally just gonna take, just gonna take the time to make this part look like a 1.0 level because man, easy gameplay is so boring. I'm excited to get to the later parts because in the later segments, I, I kind of have trouble telling what difficulty it is exactly. So I think it'll be cool when we start getting later into this. Gameplay difficulties that are much harder to tell apart. Well, I have gone back and I have essentially completed the level up to this point. Still got four minutes left. I don't really know what I'm going to do. I guess I'll build more easy gameplay. I mean, it's incredibly boring, but I'll do what I need to do, I suppose. Oh, thank God, dude. Thank God, dude. I just, I just don't get it. I don't know what I'm supposed to do, man. It's so boring. It's so boring. God, how do people make easy levels, dude? Oh, okay. Well, anywho, we get to go into normal mode, which I think normal mode is fine. I think normal difficulty is better. I feel like you're allowed to use pads and orbs in normal levels at least. So that should be good. We're going to do that now. Three, two, one, go. So we're already in a ship. Hard. I feel like maybe we can afford to get away with some more complex structures like this, maybe? I feel like this is still normal difficulty. I mean, this is kind of close to what Dryout did, and Dryout is only a hard level, I think. So I feel like this is 
fine. So I feel like this is incredibly easy ball gameplay. So surely this is easy enough to still be considered normal. I mean, honestly, if I had to choose, I would rather have this be like easy gameplay and, ac and accidentally be like undershooting than overshooting. So we got that. Uh, now I guess we'll go back in 1.0 if I the level uh, with our remaining time. I'm pretty satisfied with the normal section. I feel like it uh, is definitely distinct from the easy section. I feel like it's definitely a step up in difficulty. Not by much, uh, but by something. You know what? It's a it's a really stretch to call it this, but I'm gonna I think I'm gonna I think I'm gonna decorate. Just some nice, neat little pillars that I think look good. All right, cool. We got our block design down. This part looks pretty good, I think. Oh, cool. Okay, well, that was actually pretty good timing. All right, cool. So yeah, um, here's our part then. Pretty happy with it. Looks pretty good in my opinion. Yep, that's our normal part. Uh, so now we get to move on to hard. Hard is really, I think hard is kind of the last one of the really confusing ones to do. We're definitely gonna start using some more orbs, some different types of orbs. But hard is again in that situation where I don't really know the difference between hard, normal, and like harder. I feel like harder is much more distinguished. I'm not really sure where hard falls in? I probably should have played some hard levels and normal levels before I did this, but I don't know. We're just gonna give it a shot. Three, two, one, go. You know, we'll make the background, like, dark yellow to signify that it's hard, because, you know, the hard face is the yellow one. So, I, like I said, I definitely think we can incorporate some harder jump, well, not some harder jumps, some hard jumps, you know? <laughs> yeah, you, you get it? <laughs> I'll be here all week. Please don't unsubscribe. So these, it's still very, very easy, but I think there's like, I don't know, man. It requires a little bit more cognitive thought, I guess. See, cause now I'm like getting nervous. Cause this part, I don't know, man. It looks too hard. It, it looks like it looks like a harder gameplay. Oh man, this sucks. Oh yeah, yeah, we got a triple spike though. So that that's something. I feel like triple spikes are definitely fair game by now. I just realized, bro. I'm literally building one of those like awful, awful GD shorts, like 10 stages of difficulty thing. It literally it gets harder, bro. Like, it gets harder. What am I doing with my life? I'm, I'm, I'm becoming a shorts YouTuber. No! While I wait for my time to run out, I just figured that now would be a good time to mention that if you are enjoying the video, that you should hit subscribe, baby! Let's go! We absolutely decimated 100k, and now we're setting our sights on 200k! Subscribe before 2.2 comes out, because the blow-up is gonna be real! I guess there isn't really a need to say back to the video, because I never paused the video to do that. So I guess we're just gonna keep building. <laughs> All right, looking pretty good so far. And by so far, I mean that's it. Okay, hopefully this isn't too hard. I don't know, whatever. We're going into harder now. Harder is a difficulty I'm quite familiar with uh, because in my humble opinion, it's really the only gameplay that I used to be able to build. Um, I feel like most of my layouts back in the day were like at most like an insane nine star or eight star. So I feel pretty comfortable with harder games play. So let's uh, go ahead and do that. Three, two, one, go. I feel like we can definitely lean more into the click sync here. I feel like at this point, uh, orbs and stuff, those are all totally fine now. Um, and it's the spider too, so there's not any camera weirdness. Yeah, right? Like, I feel like this stuff is perfectly fine. Okay. I'm actually pretty happy with how this part is turning out. I think it's looking pretty good so far. I mean, yeah, because this is this is pretty similar to gameplay that I used to build. I feel like maybe it's a little bit harder in some places, because again, I feel like now I tend to build more like easy demon gameplay. Uh, so I feel like that some parts of this maybe are a little too hard, but I mean, for the most part, I think it's fine. This I could see being in a harder level, like this click, walking off onto this dash orb. Maybe these timings are a bit tight i don't know but these clicks i too i think are fine man that part actually feels like really nice to play i don't know why but that's kind of cool all right we're just gonna try and structure the end now actually not gonna get this part fully done because there's still decoration quote unquote uh, that i do want to do but i'll have to go back and do that later 
Hey, there we go. All right. All right. So insane, insane difficulty. I feel like this is basically just what I build now. Just maybe like a little bit easier. I'm not really sure. I feel like a triple speed wave is appropriate here because I feel like that's a good way to make a not really hard part feel harder uh, just because of how fast and intense it is. So we're going to use one of those. Uh, and then after that, we get to get into the demons, which those are going to ramp up real quick. Uh, but for now, three, two, one. Oh, hold on. I was off the timer. Three, two, one, go. So we got, just got a wave going on. I don't actually know how to make like exciting wave gameplay. I feel like a lot of my wave gameplay is pretty samey. Um, I think I, what I want to try and do is maybe have like a lot of structures like this kind of thing going on where you can basically see what you're meant to do, but it's sort of obscured by all the structures that are like everywhere. <laughs> uh, it'll also make this part quite easy to decorate, so I'm fine with that. <laughs> We're definitely gonna end off with that. Uh, we're gonna end up with like a little straight corridor here. Man, I don't know. This seems, this does seem too hard. I don't know, man. I feel like this isn't that hard. I feel like I could see this in an insane level. Well, I could definitely see it in an easy demon level and insane levels, not that much easier. So I feel like an easy demon, this corridor would, have, would probably have spikes in it, but I feel like just having the spam is fine. Yeah, I feel like that's fine. So we've got our wave part done and our quote unquote block design. So now we get to try and do an insane cube. We also, yeah, we're also triple speed as well, which makes things a bit more intense. Ooh, what if we throw in a fake, like this red orb here? Put an X over it though. Don't go up there. Hey, that's some sync right there. Did y'all hear that? Oh my god. There's definitely a lot more that could be done here with the structuring and block design. I don't really feel like doing that, though. Inevitably, I'll end up having to go back and, and do it off camera a little bit for the showcase part. Uh, but for now, pretty happy with this as it is. And I totally forgot about these pulsing sticks. Man, y'all clown on me when I called them that like last time in the comments. What do you call them, bro? They're pulsing music sticks. Get off my back, bro. That's literally what they are. Like, don't complain to me until y'all think of a better name for them, all right? Pulsing music sticks. Oh, hey, the timer's up. Overall, I'm pretty happy with the insane section. It's pretty good. Wow, this level's already a minute long. That's crazy. Okay, so now, uh, you know, because I don't want this level to be like four minutes long, and I also don't want this video to be like two hours long, I think that I'm gonna cut down the demon segments uh, into five minutes a piece instead of 10. Because honestly, to be fair, before 2.0 or whatever, there was only one demon difficulty anyways. So if I was making this video back in 1.9, demon would only get 10 minutes as a whole. Now it's getting 25. So I think that's what I'm gonna do. So yeah, so I guess uh, without further ado, let's hop into the Easy Demon. Five minutes, three, two, one, go. So Easy Demon gameplay is pretty cool. I'm a big fan. As I as I mentioned, it's the difficulty that I feel like I usually tend to build at automatically. So this is kind of just like building a layout for me. This part of the song is so good, dude. Oh my God, dude. How does Waterflame do it? Banger after banger. I don't understand. The man needs to be stopped. Oh, well, that was pretty fast. Haha, <laughs> sure was past me. Anyways, this is future me editing this. And unfortunately, I have to step in and say that the audio and video got really desynced and it was really inconsistent trying to mesh them together again. So instead, I'm just going to briefly explain the segments that were lost. Medium Demon. I thought this section was fine, but the ending of it, I think, might have been a bit too easy. I'm not sure. Hard Demon. This section is pretty short, but I personally think it fits pretty well and is probably pretty close to the target difficulty. Anywho, most of the Insane Demon segment onwards is in a different clean recording, so, uh, we'll pick up from there. Huge shout out to God for giving me a severe thunderstorm. I really appreciate it. Thanks for knocking out my power, man. <laughs> I almost feel like this is too hard, but I don't know how to gauge this because I don't make insane demons. I don't know how to gauge whether or not this is too hard. Uh, I'm going to speed hack this because I actually don't know if this is possible. No, it is possible. It's just stupid and bad. This sucks, dude. This is awful gameplay. There we go. Oh my god. Oh, and just on time. Okay, well, I think we're just gonna end this section anyways. Uh, and as we go to the extreme demon part, I just want to say, 
I'm sorry. Okay, so I don't even know, man. <laughs> I I do not know how extreme demon gameplay works. Especially not fun extreme demon gameplay, right? Like, I know there are extreme demons that people love. That's not what I'm gonna be making here today. Um, maybe we'll do that robot thing that I wanted to do as well. This is awful. This sucks. I've successfully made Grandpa Demon. Oh, ah, uh, okay, all right. Uh, there we have it. Here's the extreme demon part. Uh, very stupid, very silly, very bad. Uh, I don't think this gameplay is very good. And so yeah, so that is how our level, our evolving level. Um, I that's that's quite the journey. But before we end and do the showcase really quick, I'm gonna do one bonus round. 15 seconds to make an NA level. Yeah, you know, the not available rating. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna get our background color back to that good old default blue. Get our text down. All right, three, two, one, Go. Okay, quick, 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 quick. Uh, get those. Some of these, some of these. Um, those, some of those. Uh, everywhere over here. Cool, cool, cool. And time. All right. Our beautiful, beautiful level. So, uh, yeah. I'm gonna go polish this up uh, off camera for a bit. And um, I guess let's just get into the showcase then. So yeah, thank you guys very much for watching. I hope you did enjoy that. I thought it was interesting, and I thought it was also neat how I got to expose just how bad I am at uh, building certain difficulties. I hope that the easier gameplay isn't too uh, easy, and that the harder gameplay isn't too impossible. But regardless, thank you guys very much for watching. Hope you guys did enjoy that. Special thanks to all the channel members, including the Carl, Vilalder, Gato, Winterra, Not Kip, Breadboy, and HXC. Man, you guys' levels probably have the perfectly balanced difficulties. Thank you guys very much for the support means a lot to me. And uh, yeah, thank you guys very much for watching. Hope you enjoyed that. And I will see you guys in the next video.